So now to a health alert. A disturbing report came out this week about a new possible healthy superfood. It's called cockroach milk, and researchers say it's high in protein, but a certain kind of cockroach, that's the key, a certain kind of cockroach emits crystals with high levels of sugar, fat, and protein, and many scientists believe that could be used in human health food in the future. And joining me now is Kayla Fisher. She's a registered dietitian with UF Health. Kayla, um... Yeah, I don't even know where to begin with this. I don't even drink regular milk, so this just really gives me the heebie-jeebies. Mm -hmm. A lot of people it does. Um, let's start with the study. Okay. It's out of India. Yes, the study came out of India. Um, researchers were able mm -hmm. to sequence the protein they found in a milk protein crystal yeah. from a very special cockroach who gives birth to live offspring uh -huh. and then lactates. All right, tell me a little bit more about this one specific protein. Okay. So the protein crystal has been found to be a complete food, meaning it contains all three macronutrients, carbohydrates, proteins, and lipids, uh -huh. along with all nine essential amino acids, making it very rare. Now the key is, you know, we did mention this, is that it is a specific type of cockroach. Tell us. Um, the Pacific beetle cockroach. Okay. So we're not talking about just anything that no. we see crawling no, around no, no, in Florida. No, no, no. How did they come about this? How did they even discover this? Mm -hmm. That would be a question for the researchers. Um, they've been looking into this specific cockroach for a while mm -hmm. and working to sequence it. Um, so now the speculation is what can be done with these protein crystals they've discovered. All right, Kayla, I got a creepy question for you. Okay. Have you tried it? No, 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 no. <laughs> and that is a great point. So the study was um, one study preliminary findings uh -huh. that showed this protein is a complete protein, um, very high in calories, mm -hmm. and time released, meaning the protein releases slowly throughout the body. Go ahead. Michaela, I've been hearing so much about this yes. lately. Yes. What's up with that? Well, it's sensational news. Okay. It's very interesting. Okay. It's fascinating. Mm -hmm. um, but keep in mind, it's one study. There are mm -hmm. still many questions to be answered, such as, is it even safe for human yeah. consumption? Okay. Of course. <laughs> um, and so we are still a long way away from seeing these protein crystals or cockroach milk in the grocery store, in your protein shakes, or in our food supply. Okay, so now let's shift it. Let's bring it home okay. a little bit more. You're a nutritionist. Yes. Let's just kind of talk about some ways that we can get some uh, great sources of protein Absolutely. that aren't so questionable. <laughs> great question. Or make your skin yes, grow. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> uh, well, there's many foods that provide protein. Uh -huh. Of course, animal foods offer us protein, mm -hmm. um, which we can find from eggs, meat, dairy, chicken, fish, seafood, shrimp. Mm -hmm. um, however, we can even get protein from plants. So beans, mm -hmm. nuts, seeds, um, soy proteins yep. are all excellent sources of protein that we know are safe that our body uses. Now, going back to this protein that's found in the cockroach, mm -hmm. can you just kind of like uh, dissect it for <laughs> lack of a better term? Um, dissect, you know, what this protein is, um, you know, what researchers are, or rather um, the researchers from the study are saying about that? Sure. Um, the researchers are speculating that the protein could be used in protein supplements mm -hmm. in the future or added into the food supply in countries where the population is malnourished because it is a very high protein, okay. high calorie um, crystal. Okay. All right. So, um, again, when it comes down to it, this is all like very premature. Yes. And like you said, it's sensational. Absolutely. It's making headlines, um, but we can all rest assured this is a long way away mm -hmm. from being a question whether you decide if you want almond milk or cockroach milk. <laughs> 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 all right. And Kayla, you know, a lot of times this you know, comes about, like with diets, people hear about fads and they yes. want to jump on it. Yes. What do people need to keep in mind before trying new things out, like a new protein supplement? Yes, that's a great question. Um, Research evidence-based nutrition is the best way to be eating, which generally means not jumping on that bandwagon okay. of the next headline you see on the news. Uh, there's a lot of things we know <laughs> uh -huh. our body needs, and yeah. they're always um, excellent advice, like eating more fruits and vegetables, yep. more beans, um, okay. lean proteins. Those are things we can do every day. Excellent. Kayla, thank you so very much You're for welcome. setting the record straight about yes. this cockroach milk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so if you want to learn more about this, there's a story on our website, newsforjacks.com.